In today's Lee's Lost and Found, we're taking another shot at finding a couple of long lost dogs. Here's Lee Moody with their story. Lisa, thanks. We'd love to get some answers for these families as 2023 comes to an end. Both dogs went missing back in early summer, and it would be a Christmas miracle to get them back home. We've all been really worried about, you know, with it becoming, you know, the colder season, if he's, you know, if he's okay. Addison Garrett hasn't given up on finding her boyfriend's mother's lost dog, Marmaduke. He got out of a gate off North Nichols in Brown in Springfield on June 1st. <laughs> he's a pit bull Malamute Husky mix and was wearing a gray collar at the time. The Lee's Lost and Found community has helped look for Marmaduke the last six months, but so far, no luck. Addison says she has a gut feeling she knows what happened and is hoping this TV coverage will help find him. I feel like he's still out there, but he's with someone that just doesn't have the, the resources to look on Facebook or go out or anything, stuff like that. So that's what I am think. Our other long lost dog is Baby, owned by Brandy Gress of Nevada. Took her to the vet on July 1st to have her boarded. And the next morning they called me and said that they took her out on a walk and that she chewed the leash and got off. That was at the Nevada Veterinary Clinic. Workers say they spotted her at a nearby golf course, but there have been no other credible sightings. I've had lots of people like call me or message me and say that they had found her or possibly had found her. But I mean, you know, there's a lot of black and white dogs out there and none of them have been her at all. I don't I don't think she was picked up because she she was very she's a very nervous dog. She was on meds for anxiety. And um I don't think that anybody could have got a hold of her. Now she will she will growl at you and bark, but she she's never bit anybody. She's just scared. Brandy is hoping baby has just been hiding and surviving. She says the last six months have been brutal and she just wants answers. Yeah I've I've had to get on some depression meds and yeah. It's been pretty rough. If you see either of those dogs or you know anything, I've included their owner's contact information in this story posted on ky3.com, or you can send in any tips here to my Lee's Lost and Found Facebook page, and I'll go ahead and pass them on.